Hello and welcome back, friends and family, to Ratchet and Clank. I'm Octoax and this is Ratchet and Clank. This time we're going to save that commando. That's, like, the reason we came here. T to begin with. Why did we take that path? Well, because I knew the time constraints and I knew that path was... Can you just come down here so I can kill you? Thank you. There we go. And, of course, since I paid for the fucking info bot, I can't afford that shit. Well then, and that's fine. Oh, these guys. These guys are so stupid. I move a little to the side and they just keep shooting in a straight line. Idiots. And he just shot his friend. Oh, I got hit. Whatever. Okay, explosions. That is not what I want for Christmas. Because all I want for Christmas is you. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, I shouldn't do that. I, sh I shouldn't do that. Okay. I think... Is that... Yes, there is a spawner up here. Ugh. These guys. Oh, often the spawner has a lot of ammo in uh, Not ammo. Bolts in them. Also, there's a golden board right there. Which we are going to grab very soon. Um, hello? Do -do -do -do. No? Okay. Goodbye. Oh, I can do that. I can do that. Let's let's do that. Can guy? Guy? Can you just jump out here so I can kill you? There we go. Okay. Um I just thought of something I should do. Let's just pick up the gold bolt first. Because that seems like the smart thing to do. And also go into this door and then we'll do that thing that I just thought of. Because I am so smart. I am so smart. SMRT. Okay. Got it. You obtained a golden bolt. Which is not what it says, but, you know, it is what I did. So you could just flip off, you uncle bitch. One of these things. This is the point where these become a little harder. Because you get multiple lasers that don't have to hit a thing. I think... Can I... No... Oh, there you go. Nice. And basically every, all that is here is... Large amounts of bolts. So you can get all of your riches. You need all of the riches. And that's pretty much... Oh, I got that 10,000 bolts. Let's grab that Devastator. Back to the vendor, back to the vendor, 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 hello. Okay. The Devastator. Obtained. Got it. Okay. So, I'll see you on the, the planet thing. What I realized was that we could go back here to uh, Skid's manager and give the thing for the hoverboard challenge. So, there we go. Work, kid. So, are you gonna represent? Please do. You bet, kid. And as a signing bonus, I've got this cool helmet. Indeed. That is a sonic summoner. It is used to attract sand mice. Right, and it's all yours. <laughs> well, I'm off to finalize the paperwork. I'll have my people call your people. Do you have people? A sonic summoner no. allows you to interact with the mysterious and intelligent sand mice species, despite their. So, you see, this must be footage sand from beta because that's not how they hunters. count enemies and Simply stuff now, which you have to defeat. When you are near a sand mouse house and a mouse, sand mouse house. You. I like rhyming. If the mouse likes you. It may offer a bit of high caliber tactical assistance. I still don't know why they're called sand mice though, but we found a little hut here and we get one of those. And I just realized that it's pretty stupid to come back here right now because I need the the magnet boots to get up here and we'll get them soon. But whatever. Whatever, we'll come back again. Okay, I'll meet you back at the place. Okay, so what I saw that reminded me of this was I saw this little hut right here. So I'll bring up the guy. Also, because I've seen these, because when you play this game once or twice, you kind of have to, you see these little huts, 
And you like remember, oh right, that's that's about that. Um, and I saw one on the way to the hoverboard challenge, which makes no sense whatsoever because you need the thing from the hoverboard challenge to get the Sonic Summoner. So why would they even have it right there? Because you don't go back. Oh, the guy disappeared. Oh shit. It wasn't too much use. I could kill those guys easily. Whatever. No, that doesn't really make sense. A lot of this game doesn't make sense, I'm coming to realize. Dude, just, just, just die by my flamethrower. Go away, sir. Nobody likes you. Oh, bomb. Oh, bomb. Oh, bomb. Don't you dare run away. Stop electrocuting stuff. You're not welcome to do that. That is actually very mean. Nobody... Don't do that. Stop it. I'm gonna die. No, you do not, sir. You're dead now. Now I'm pissed. I'm pissed now. I don't... I don't recollect this thing. I don't know what that means, but... Fuck it. Okay, so now I have to build this bridge. Which is a thing... I don't fucking know. And then, it actually will spawn a fucking tank. Did you see that up in the corner? It spawned a fucking tank. I think the enemy is actually called a fucking tank. I wouldn't be surprised. I think we can, we can actually kill it from here. Yeah, so we don't have to deal with that shit. Because those are actually pretty hard. If it's not... If you don't already... If you haven't already noticed, my favorite gun so far is the, the Parocitor. Because it is so good. And since you can't aim guns, it's very use. It's like, because you can do this and get like the area around you. What the hell did you come from? Where the hell did you come from? What? And probably it was some sort of robot factory. I don't know. I'm not a science person. I don't fucking know. Why am I southern today? I don't fucking know. <laughs> but if we take this off beaten path as it is um, there will actually be a a golden bolt a gold bolt right around here hello yeah so we already found two gold bolts in this episode that's pretty and we haven't gotten that far because I went back for the thing and the thing and the thing so that's the thing Um, but we did need to help that commando with, with, with something. What did he even want? He wanted to meet us for something. All oh, right, take down those things, because those are not pleasant. I wonder what kind of war is going on here. We only have we. Okay, we've only seen like two. Don't do that. Oh d fuck! I'm dead. Really? Back here? Oh, but I think the, the, the thing is open. The bridge is... Is open, so we don't need to do that at least. Let's go get it. No! I'm, I still want my helmet on! I still don't know why there's a fucking... Note. To describe the sonic emitter. That's stupid. Okay, let's take the sand mice. Fuck these guys. I do apologize for the burp. Ugh. Oh, God. Oof. I am not well in the stomach. Don't. Oh, bye, guy. Billy. Like, Are you okay? Okay. That wasn't funny. Why did I do that? <laughs> I think yes the bridge but that means the the thing place out mines to kill the guy to, 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 okay all oh, right we have the sand mice to help thank you sand mice sand mouse that actually helped me a lot also we had the dip don't damn it I was gonna kill that guy okay can we actually snipe the guys from here yes can we snipe the other guy too no? Okay. 
Oh, he was like off range by far. This we can do. No, don't. I shall murder you in your sleep. Y you want some? You fucking want some, dude? I didn't think so. Can you just die? There we go. I missed. There you go. And now it's just the bottom. And there we go. Nice. I'm glad I bought the Devastator. This is the most epic voice I can make. It's not very impressive, is it? I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. I think there's like... Yep. I knew you guys were here. Don't escape my wrath. I shall kill you with my weaponry. I mean, if that wasn't obvious enough. And no, okay, I see you. So don't even. F He's in here because I see his ears. So if we actually put a mine right there, I think. Yep, got him. I, I don't think I've never I uh, I don't think I've ever thought of that to do that. Okay, that actually left a big explosion, or that was there before. I don't know. I didn't look. There's nobody up here, and I think across this bridge is the commando. So we'll talk to him, and he'll tell us that we need stuff. Blast that thing! It won't budge. I've tried everything I know short of nuclear weaponry. Hmm. No, never mind. Well, you tried. See ya. Not so fast, soldier. You're going into that compound even if I have to throw Do it. you. Aha. That ventilation shaft leads to the turret platform. Well, isn't so that convenient? Way to use that shaft to infiltrate the compound undetected. Hmm. You've shown bravery by making it this far, soldier. And for that, I reward you. I intercepted this communique that you might find useful. Take it. I'm off to find my battalion. Good There's a lot of info bots around here. Hello once again, fellow blog. I hope this message finds you well. As many of you know, our home planet is no longer habitable. We've abandoned our factories, our laboratories, and our happy lives because of the encroaching pollution, leaving much behind. You get it? The nearby planets will supply it's, us with it's all a thing we about need to create it, our the environment, home, which is nearing completion. You get the message. Once our scientists locate the Recycle, ideal kids. Orbit, our new world will be perfect. So reserve your space now. Prime locations are filling up fast. Good day. Now do you understand why we must stop him? He won't rest until he has destroyed every planet in the galaxy. Yeah? Well, I got bigger fish to fry. Bigger than the galaxy? Well, different fish. Anyway. Yeah. Look, didn't that commando guy say we could get into that compound? Yes, by using the ventilation shaft. But we will need something special to walk on that. Magnet boots. Fine. Let's get going then. Spoilers. Back, Sorry. So yeah, the whole thing is an environmental thing, which I mean, when I was a kid, not a big deal. But right, but now when when it's kind of up in your face. He kind of says, yeah, I became evil in trying to create my own planet because our planet became such shit because we didn't take care of it. I mean, it makes you kind of go, eh, really, dude? Really, dude? Oh, boxes. I need boxes for money. Money and riches. I am not going, be going to be able to buy that, that rhino, am I? I don't think so. Okay, let's go to the gas bar. To infinity and beyond. This looks trouble. Straight up lava planet. Okay, then. Let's grab these boxes first. They always leave boxes behind you. 
So let's just go take care of that first because, as I said, we need the riches. We need the riches. And I think instead of following the obvious path, we're going to take this sneaky little path right here. Because I don't think we have time for more than... Oh, God. Okay, we made it. Um, so this path is just here to get a golden bolt and a skill point. But, as I've said, I... Either in this episode or the last episode, I am going to do the whole, the whole, you know, skill points at the end of the LP. Because it's easier than, you know, keeping track of all that, plus the gold bolts. I don't know how I'm going to do with Ratchet & Clank 2 when I eventually play that. When I play Ratchet & Clank, the movie, the game, I'm not going to try to 100% it, because that will be a blind let's play. So, yeah, the skill point, by the way, is killing all of those ships. And some you have to kill to, like, traverse forward. So, that's a thing. Um, that I will not be playing 100% because it's new to me, too. And playing a game blind 100% is very hard. I mean, I've never done it, but, you know, it, it's. I'm guessing it's pretty damn hard. Because you have to look up stuff and, like, have order and stuff. And then you can't really react to the game and what it throws at you. Which I I think it's the, the whole idea of a blind let's play. Um, but I don't know how I'm going to do with 2. If you guys want me to play 2. Because uh, I do... I basically only play the games that you guys want me to play. Well, I didn't make you vote on this game because I really wanted to play it. So you can just you, just, you can just suck on that lemon. Um, but for the new year, I don't know, mate. We'll see. Uh, I think I'll, I'll try to juggle two Let's Plays again. Uh, I don't know how I'm going to do with Binding of Isaac if I'm going to finish that. Because the update came and I don't, mm, I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to do with that. But that I might do that sometime. Uh, like sometime every month or something like that. Because it's not really fun either. Because oh god. Oh god. I'm dead. I'm dead. Just floating into your doom. And that's a Mario thing with a butt. Okay, yeah, we're dead. Shit. And we start here. That's kind of unforgiving with this game. The checkpoints. Not a lot of them. Not a lot of them. But we can just traverse this fast. I know it. I know we can. If we just skip the enemies, we can do that. See, I'm speedrunning. That is the thing. I've talked about how I tried to speedrun the second game. Um, I realized you can't really do that with the first game either. Because you need the... Or the second one. But I didn't realize that, realize that at the time. But you need bolts to get info bots and stuff. Like in the last episode we have to we had to pay 2000 bolts to um, get the info bot of that uh, that army guy who tried to get the bus who, who needed to go on the bus to get home to his family. He needed to go to college. See, I remember shit like that. Um no, but you can't really do that. Um, I don't know if there's like a speed running record for Ratchet Clank any game. That would be pretty cool to, to see, though, if there were a speedrunning uh, playthrough or tactics, even. I'd like to know some speedrunning tactics for Ratchet and Clank. That would be pretty awesome. I, I didn't even need to go that way. Why did I do that? Just for the boxes, dude? That's greedy. That's greedy. I'm becoming Ratchet, basically. And that also, in the movie... I didn't mention it, but I realized it like two minutes ago. Um, that um, I talked about how greedy Ratchet is in this game and how greedy he is not going to be in the movie. Um, Quark is even more greedier than Ratchet is, but I don't think he's going to be greedy either. I mean, he's going to be his old, you know, suck up, or not really suck up, but selfish, egotistical self. But he's not going to be like, I'm going to kill you because I want stuff. Which he's doing now. 
Which I guess he's done for the greedy thing, but uh, I don't really, I don't know, mate. It's hard to decipher. Don't jump. No. We are at the end of the thing. You can't do this to me, Ratchet. Okay, there we go. Use your fucking helipack. It, it wouldn't even... I held in the button, but it didn't want to use the, the fucking helipack. God damn it. Okay. So that was a pointless detour. And that is going to be, that as we take the ride back, that is going to be it for this episode of Ratchet and Clank. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and all the fun stuff. And I'll see you next time.